Hello, my feathered friends. My name is Peacock920. And we're going to try something new with automation. I have compiled a list of all the different race types from Forza that we're going to kind of keep ourselves to. Such as sports utility, hero, off-roader type stuff. I've got them listed here. We're going to roll a dice. Whichever one we hit is the one we'll use. And then we'll also be using a dice to choose the year making... Well, not making model. We'll choose a model based on what we get from this first. Actually, to be more precise, let me get a dice ready. Okay. So what we're going to do is roll a 20 dice for the first year. Um, we're going to roll for all four digits of the year make. Not year. Yes, year. No make. <laughs> if we get an odd number, it'll be a uh, 1900s or something. But if we get an even, it'll be more modern into the 20, 2000s. What do we get? We get a 16, so it's actually going to be a lot newer. But, um... Are we going to be into 2020? Or is it going to be... Okay, 2011. That's what we're going to go with. 2011. That's not too bad. We're still in a good area for cars. Now, let me count up. So there's a total of 29. And we get the third one, which is off-road buggy. And you know what? Fair enough. I've not made an off-road buggy in a while. I think I think I've only made one. I guess it doesn't really count as a buggy, but more of a rally kind of car. What well, essentially counts as off-road buggy? That's that's what I'm kind of wondering. Okay, none of my stuff wants to search, so that's going to be fun to figure out. Unless it's my internet. Did my internet die? Is that what's going on? Okay, uh, let me pause for a second. Come back. Once I figure this out. Okay, so we can essentially use any car we'd like. As long as it has oversized tires.
And you know what? I want to use a wagon. I haven't seen many wagons been turned into a buggy. So why not? 2011. Whatever the hell. <laughs> Call it Dave. A Dave, what you might call it. There you go. Ah, uh, let's see. We're going for lightweight. Even though it's the wagon. I'm going to make it all-wheel drive. You know what? Let's do that. We're going to roll a dice to see what engine we use. So out of the four options, we use whatever the third one has. And we got four different options. Roll a number, number. Oh. Just because I want the all-wheel drive, we're going to make it a little bit bigger. There we go. This is going to be such a strange... Dual, but nothing. And just for the fun, we're gonna put it on meth. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and we can increase it. We're gonna actually give it a little bit more RPM, but that's about it. See how high we can bring this. Not that high, apparently. Oh wait, exhaust. We could probably increase that and bring more power in. Uh, boost, 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 more boost. Yes, boost, 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 and then it's gonna explode right here or something. I don't know. Wouldn't that be hilarious? Just boom. Knocking is soon to happen. Open that up a little bit more, and that'll give us something. One heck of an off road car, eh? Uh, let's put a little bit. No, we can't do compression anymore and it'll explode. 
die into a burn pile for some reason. I want to do reverse flow. Just to make sure it doesn't overly be loud. Advance. Because even way down here, it's still got enough horsepower to kick itself around a corner. Idle, it's using 92 horsepower. <laughs> That's more than a beetle. Boost? Hey, there it is. That's what we want. Alright, let's see what we can do. There it is. Just increase this until it goes from one to zero. There it is. That is such a fun. That's such a fun. Alright. I want to keep the that, yeah. You know what? Yeah, make it longer just for the fun of it. No. <laughs> As fun as that would be, I don't want it like that. Let's make it orange. We've been making too many red cars. Yes. Wait, what? I don't know why that actually kind of fits the design.
No. <laughs> My god. I don't know whether to be amazed that it looks terrible or to be happy that it looks terrible. Because either way, it's hilarious to me. so you can see past this giant arch. I have what to do but place an antenna right there. Yeah. What kind of wheel should we put on this? Considering it's 2011. Give her that. <laughs> Alright, let me finish the rest of this car and I'll come back. And here we are, MVMG, with the finished car. It's got the big tires, it's got raised suspension, it's pretty much off road buggy. We're gonna take it for a drive. Oh boy. Let's turn off all of the ESC down there.
Oh, oh no. It's a pancake. Oh, good. It's a wedge. It's become a wedge. Engine is still alive, even though it's right there, squashed. I don't know how. This is really fun to drive. It's hilarious just how fast it is. And there it goes. <laughs> Let's do a little uh, configuring here. If we go in, need a little bit more gear here. Just so it doesn't reach its top speed so quickly. There we go. <laughs> Let's do a little bit more configuring because we could probably go faster than that. do that.
think we got a flat tire. Yeah. Definitely a flat. Alright, so I haven't even gotten to the fun bit. I made a second car. And <laughs> you may have seen this one right before we took off with the first one. I just called this the Bug E. B U G E. And it's got huge tires. I did put a little bit of weight re uh, distribution to the front with the engine being in the back, but it still does wheelies whenever it wants and decided to kick out the tires. And unlike the other one that I made, this is rear wheel drive. And a flat six. With twin turbo. That's a little weird. I made this all-wheel drive. That would have been much better at doing this. get up there, I guess. If I can't do it my way, I'll do it another way. Just because it's working. Whoops. Oh well, it's fun to drive. <laughs> They're both fun to drive, actually. But, uh, if you're enjoying this, these, uh, car making videos, automation, and BMG, let me know by hitting that like button down below. If you're new to the channel, subscribe, share the video, and ring that bell to get notifications when I upload. In the comments, leave a suggestion to mods, games, and other things like that. And for now, peace.